Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryda Mataro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash the like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody. Now this video is all about on how to install the music locker in single player. So like always make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below. This mod does require the latest version for Lemon UI and I will leave this inside my description below. Now next you can use Simple Trainer or enable all interiors. It's all totally up to you but for this method I'll be using Simple Trainer. So download Simple Trainer and I will leave this inside my description below. You can use enable all interiors, it's totally up to you. What we need is to enable MP maps, that's all. Now make sure that you do have the latest skithookv.net nightly, it is required. Once you have finished downloading all of your files, let's get started. First go to your Grand Theft Auto V game hover over it, right click and open file location. Now make sure that you do install your skithookv.net nightly. Once you have completed that, then go to your skits folder. First, open up your lemon UI extract folder. Go to your shvdn3 folder. Select the three files and drag it inside your skits folder the exit out of your extract folder. Now next, open up your enable all interiors, go to enable all interiors mod, go to this one, and now select all the files except for the lemon download.txt and drag it inside your skits folder. That's only if you're using enable all interiors to enable MP maps. But unfortunately, I'm not using enable or interiors, so I'll just exit out of that. If you're using Simple Trainer to enable all interiors, then go to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder and now just only paste it inside your main folder. You'll see it's over here, okay? TrainerV.i9. So you'll see it right there, okay? Now go back to your scripts folder, okay? And now open up your music locker mod extract folder. Then go over to this folder, then go to your scripts and simply select all the files and folder except for the 11 download.txt and drag it inside your scripts folder. Then exit out of your extract folder. That's all you gotta do. Now go and exit out of your game folder, right click, refresh your desktop and I will see you in the game. And now we are in the game with Franklin. So once you're in the game, okay, all you gotta do to enable MP maps with Simple Trainer is press F3, then go to teleporting. Now if you wanna know how to uh, interact with the menu just use your num pad okay and now press 5 and then now go to the other side to other teleports 1 then press 5 and now go right in the middle and you'll see enable MP maps now press 5 and now your game will freeze for only a few seconds and now that's all you gotta do to enable MP maps. Now, if you're using enable all interiors, you'll need to pop up your phone, then go to your contacts, then go right down the bottom and you'll see 
enable all interiors and now just click on that okay then go right down the bottom to MISC options and now you gotta enable your MP maps and even your blips and now exit out of your menu then now go down the bottom to your main menu and now press refresh okay and then that's all you gotta do and now exit out of your phone and that's how you enable your MP maps using enable all interiors so once you have finished with that okay then now you will kind of have to come to the location everybody knows where the location is uh, it's basically under the casino so I'll see you guys there and now we are at the casino so this is the location okay okay and you'll see this door over here now when you go to the door you'll see on your top left hand side it says press E to open the door so press E as you can see you've got music blocker and now there's a menu on top on your left hand side that is bugging you to remove that is press your zero key on your numpad then now it will go away now come over here and now you can purchase for your entry fee now I don't know if you can go in for free I haven't uh, tried that out but you can try it if you can I don't know if this security will kick you up but you can try it <laughs> Now over here, you have, okay, you can interact over here by changing the DJ to whatever you want. It's totally up to you. Now unfortunately, I do have the video on mute, okay, the game. So it won't uh, catch that copyright, you know. Now come over here and now you can change the lighting. Now I do like this one over here. That one there. Wait, wait, there you go. I do like that. I do like down over there. It's pretty awesome. So, yeah, and now you can come over here to drink your whiskey uh, and get drunk. Okay, and now you can come over here too. I forgot to mention. Uh, you can order your drinks over here to whatever drink you want. Okay. Um, yeah, this is like the. Uh, nightclub and now you got your security now over here this is what I mean about the casino so you can go to your casino uh, to your casino penthouse or whatever and to the roof and etc but we're not going to go there okay now this is the bathroom okay and toilets um, nothing really major in here and this looks like uh, oh, okay and yeah I know what it is I'm not gonna say it um, yeah and now you can come over here and get your groove on start dancing and now you can come over here and just go like that and now use the radio if you want to change the station and pretty much that's hey like, can you move away and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's okay for the mod. It is a cool mod and it's a convenient mod to play around with. But overall, it is a cool mod and I really do enjoy using this mod. So I hope you guys do enjoy it. And now we're back again. So I hope you guys do enjoy using the mod. It's an awesome mod. But like always, if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that or if you do get stuck installing any other mods from GTA V or Cyberpunk then let me know in the comments below and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that as well unfortunately I'm not active inside my YouTube comments I am more active inside my discord server so join my discord server I'll leave the link inside my description below so you guys can get more help and more support inside my discord server so with that all said if you guys did enjoy this video or if this video was helpful please smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials and i'll see you all on my next video thank you for watching 
Peace. And now I'm out.